what is going on YouTube it's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I will be updating my PS3 hand to the latest version 2.0.2 there are some changes in this new version and I will go over that in the video as well so let's go ahead guys and get started so right over here guys at PSX place um, we got the update release and it says that it supports the PS2 classic um, launcher now so I'll make a video on this when I have the time and further down we have the change log and the stock um, frame binary this will unlock your demos by default and also the PS3 hand payload this will activate your wrap files on your USB stick so if you have your USB stick all you have to do is make a folder called xdata and then put all your wraps inside there you can use the right port on the PS3 or the left port okay they also showed that um, a bunch of more things have been added also the hybrid firmware tool is now available on your XMB so that's good um, they, they have also fixed the infinity spinning icon whenever you're inside a game and you press the PS button you will get this infinity spinning icon right so they have fixed that now and they also added the N um, updater supported available under the network category so we're gonna go over a bunch of these stuff in the video um, official firmware update via internet blocked so they blocked the the automatic download on your PS3 so you won't aut um, accidentally update your PS3 that's good uh, so yeah le let's just go over and get started okay so right here guys I have uh, um, my PKG that I'm gonna be using bejeweled and I also have the wrap file so what you want to do is just make a folder and call this one xdata that's it now copy the wrap file and drop it right there okay now just copy your game and copy the xdata folder copy it and paste it on your USB stick make sure that your USB stick is formatted to FAT32 so just go ahead and paste it there okay so we copied over the xdata folder and the pkg game so I'm gonna go back now and I'm gonna go inside the updated ps3 hen folder I'm gonna copy the boot plugin the HDD installer PS3 hand bin and the stock frame bin go ahead and copy head over to your USB stick and just paste them right here okay so that's done so let's head over to the PS3 now guys okay so now that we're on the PS3 make sure that you plug the USB in the right port or you can also use the left port it doesn't matter but I like using the right port when I'm installing the PS3 hen and whenever you're activating the PS3 hen you need the right port so I would definitely recommend using the right port okay so just log into your user and you want to go over to internet browser right here press X when you get to right here you should have a blank page you should know how to set this part up already so press start and you want to go over to ps3exploit.com go up to the part where it says ps3 hen go to the first one where it says hen han pkg blind so it's enabling hand press yes press circle and exit the browser now go over to your package manager install standard and as you can see we have the the hen version 2.0.2 .2 at the top so we're gonna install this okay once it's finished installing go ahead and press circle go all the way over here and reboot your PS3 alright so once you have rebooted your PS3 go ahead and log back in and you want to go ahead and activate your hen you can do it from right here 
or you can do it from the internet browser I like to do it from the internet browser it works a lot faster for me okay so I'm just gonna press select and go to PS3 hand enabler I'm gonna press initialize hand enabler that's it enable hand and that's it okay so once hen has been enabled if you go up top you will see the hybrid um, firmware you can easily press X you have the soft reboot hard reboot in-game settings you have the screenshots right here so when you're inside a game playing that game you can easily um, screenshot the game you have the overwrite disk SFO I'll do a video about this one so make sure that you guys look out for a video for this settings right here um, we have the dump tools right here we also have the service tool this one right here will display what what's the lowest your console can downgrade to so it's a mini ver check so if you press X there it is Minim minimum downgrade we have this right here, the check files, rebuild database, um, theme select, and we also have the PS3 hand up data. Okay, all right, so go over here to your package manager, and you want to go ahead and install standard, and here is the game. Just go ahead and press X and install the game. No need to sign the game, guys okay so the game has complete installing so press circle here's the game right here as you guys remember um, I did not um, sign the wrap file into a PKG it was the raw wrap files okay so let me go over here and show you guys remember that I made the X data folder and I put all the wrap file right here so that's all you have to do no need to sign a wrap file over to PKG and all of that so just go ahead right now and press X and play the game it should be activated and there it is there it is guys no need to convert wrap file to PKG and sign and whatever none of that is required right now it's a lot easier all you have to do is put all 14,000 wrap files inside the, your X data folder on your USB stick and that's it so I'm gonna quit the game okay guys so I just quit the game let's go ahead and reboot the PS3 and I'm gonna show you guys something okay guys so I just reboot the, the PS3 just log into your user let's go over here to the game and look at this now guys if I try to play the game I'm gonna get this renew license message okay so all you have to do is just go ahead and enable your hen enable your hen from right here or the internet browser and that's it you can play the game the wrap files will be activated on your PS3 all you have to do is keep the, the USB stick plugged into your USB let's try it again there you go and there it is guys very simple very easy guys no need to convert wrap files to PKG anymore alright so guys if the video was helpful please leave a like also share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come thank you all for watching I will see you guys in my next video